Welcome back, Egyptians, to Truly Divinely Sent. Ancestors closest to the sun, please help me channel this message. Please tune into my frequency or allow me to tune into yours. Please protect me as I channel through this energy. All ancestors closest to the sun, you may remain. All others, you must leave. Okay. So, what I have in this energy today is um, there is somebody who is having a very challenging time when it comes to um, leaving a situation, okay? This is a masculine who is desperately trying to hang on to a feminine here. This person looks like they are up under pressure here. Um, as far as the divine feminine, I do see a divine masculine that is coming, that is definitely, it says distant future here in real love, okay? So I'm seeing that there is a divine party for whoever you are. However, there is somebody that is still mixed up in your energy here and cannot get over the fact that um, things are um, no longer moving for them or going in their, in their favor in regards to you, okay? I'm seeing that there is absolutely no sparks when it comes to the situation. And because of that, this person is very angry okay i'm seeing health here as well this could be something that is going on in this person's head um i'm also seeing that there is somebody who is watching you um do it do what you do somebody is watching you do what you do and they have a lot of toxic thoughts okay when it comes to whatever it is that you do i guess for work here okay wow the magician here okay so whatever you do with your gifts okay this is what i'm getting here this person is having a hard time accepting you moving forward here we have careless we have bitter so this person is definitely up under a lot of pressure um i'm seeing message here as well so there's somebody that wants to say something to you we will uncover what it is that this person is trying to um say to you all right we have cauldron that, that came out here from cauldron i am picking up on um some sort of spiritual tie or spiritual connection here okay i'm getting that i'm not really getting love spell but i'm getting when it came out with ladder i'm getting that there's somebody who's trying to basically curse your um advancements or curse you going higher up the chain this is what i'm getting here curse whatever it is that you have coming in for you okay i'm getting 40 um with this 40 here i'm getting 40 days 40 nights so you could have 40 days and 40 nights before something happens for you okay before it starts to rain this is what i'm getting here i'm getting the um information of lot not lot i'm sorry not lot was not noah okay the information of noah where it rained for 40 days and 40 nights but i'm getting that it is going to rain for you for 40 days and 40 nights or you have until 40 days and 40 nights something of that nature there okay whatever this is somebody is possibly talking bad on it or wishing bad on it or thinking okay thank you ancestors toxic thoughts okay somebody is thinking bad on whatever progress you have coming up coming up all right we have acorn showing up here in reverse this is, this represents growth here but by it showing up here in reverse this is somebody that does not want you to grow this is somebody that is not looking to see you expand here there is somebody um okay i'm getting feel, feelings of somebody still in a family okay so there's whoever this person is that is attached to you this person feels i guess this is giving me like future information here when they're doing this divine masculine finally makes his way to you this person here is going to feel like somebody stole his family okay i'm sorry i had to it came so i had to say it all right as far as back to this whatever somebody is doing to basically curse your bag or curse any advancements it looks like that's being automatically turned returned to sender this looks like there's some sort of a protection here that you have um in regards to this yeah this is what i'm seeing here is somebody looking in the mirror and all of whatever toxic thoughts that they are thinking are being shot right back at them okay they're only seeing themselves okay so that's what's reflect that's they are reflecting themselves okay we got feather here we got hand and we got wheel okay so th this is definitely return to sender all right i'm getting that there is somebody here to end the energy that is very a very powerful earth angel here whoever you are you are throwing something back to someone 
okay the power is in your hands is what i'm getting here but you're returning something um i'm seeing the wheel of fortune spin but i'm getting that it. it's spinning the other way you're returning something back to sender here okay whoever this person is this person is possibly scared and afraid that you have cut all ties with them okay this is what i'm getting however this person is up to no good kind of sneaky in the energy here as they're learning something about you all right i am seeing that they possibly are learning how protected you are they're also learning that they cannot come in between whatever coin that you have here i am seeing the devil okay and the trumpet here as well so i'm getting that um the devil is being made known here okay i'm getting that they with the cat energy there's somebody sneaking around in your energy but somebody else is is basically speaking through like uh some sort of a shafar okay somebody is speaking through like a shafar warning basically you okay so i'm getting that whoever you are you have very powerful um protectors very powerful uh angels that protect you as well here okay i'm getting that there is somebody here that is going to be very upset in this energy all right because somebody you somebody feels like you have walked all over them all right and they see you as a spider here the spider shows up as a very powerful feminine energy here okay this is the energy that i'm getting we got the world showing up here in reverse okay along with the tower so whatever this is this is something that you have long ago put to an end here all right somebody is having their tower and i'm getting that whatever tower this is this is something that is con in, in continue continuation okay or continuous okay there's some sort of continuous type of con uh challenge that this person is going through okay this person may end up trying to compete with you but for the most most part i'm feeling that this person is a little bit um wrapped up in their head okay with under pressure here this person is trying to figure out a way back into your energy all right they're seeing you as being very um filled with glee all right this is somebody who's seeing that you're very happy where you are um not only are you happy but you are enjoying where you are right now very enlightened okay these people are seeing or this person is seeing you in the light and it makes them very grumpy i just got grumpy smurf okay i don't know if that is grumpy smurf okay the grouch this is the energy that i'm getting whoever this person is they're very stressed out okay very stressed out um this person is saying i don't care i don't care about nothing that you do i don't care about nothing that you do but this person cares about everything that you do this person is very bitter here in the energy as well all right this person is lightweight losing their mind very loopy about you um there is conversations that's being had about you as well but i'm seeing here in your energy um there's no sparks here no longer sparks okay toxic thoughts here i don't see that those are your thoughts it's toxic thoughts about what direction you're headed in as far as your spiritual work spiritual path spiritual ascension here okay there's a lot of talk i see thief here okay so this is somebody who's basically talking to other people about the fact that you could have possibly stolen their heart all right we have worked through your fears okay so i'm getting that you are somebody who are you could be a scorpio okay you could be a water sign here okay but i'm getting that there are some things that is going to make you afraid to continue to move forward or this is something that has happened in your past but you've gotten past this here okay your commitment is being tested okay so ancestors are saying um when it comes to your fears understand that that is only a test of your reality here okay ancestors are saying there is nothing to fear as long as you as long as you feel that you are walking in the direction that you're supposed to be going to towards okay work through your fears and your commitment is being tested here again um the ancestors are definitely um, trying to see whether or not you will make it over whatever this is this person is definitely going to be coming towards you if this person is not here now um it's definitely meant for this person to come towards you i'm getting that this person is um you know this stays in the energy it stays in the energy because there is a lot of people who whoever past person this is this person hasn't come to you yet okay this is somebody lingering 
all right and i'm not getting it as just one person this is somebody lingering in your energy and this energy is going to show up until that particular person come and test your fears okay come and test your progress come and test your spirituality okay i'm getting that you guys are on two opposite spectrums here you are here spiritual work and they are chaos okay they are having some sort of a downfall when it comes to spirituality here but um this is going to continue to be in the energy until whoever this is that is lurking in somebody's energy comes forward but ancestors are saying you have to hold your vision whatever it is that you see for yourself hold it steady at that i am getting that there is going to be some sort of eclipsing of energy um for this full moon that is coming up okay i gotta i gotta see when the full moon is okay it's close because i can feel it but um ancestors are saying hold your vision whatever it is that you see for yourself keep that okay step out of your comfort zone so this is what i'm getting i'm getting that um whoever you are um you you you've had a comfort zone for so long okay you are somebody who may easily step back into a situation just because it is comfortable for you but ancestors are saying it's time for you to step out of your comfort zone um during this moon wherever you sit wherever you are in your energy or in your healing is where you're going to be fixed for a little bit here this is what i'm getting here okay whoever this person is this person is not your soulmate if you were confused and didn't know whether or not this person was your soulmate or not this person is not your soulmate however this person is going to come back to you and say something about getting together okay this person is going to say something about getting together with you all right listen can you silence that please all right so this person has something that they want to say to you all right so let's see what it is that they want to say to you okay whatever it is is going to be some sort of manipulation okay so whatever message that they are trying to give you is going to be some sort of manipulation in regards to a divine masculine okay i'm getting that in this energy this is um they're going to be talking to you about your new person okay trying to manipulate you about your new person here okay this is the energy all right this person is going to have a lot to say okay with the phone ringing at that time this is what they're they're trying to talk to you about a new person okay this is the energy here warning you this is what i'm getting warning signs okay give me what is, what, what is this person trying to say okay this person is definitely trying to express themselves as well this is the energy rich guy thief okay so i'm getting that yeah this person is basically saying that um wow they're gonna be talking about a lot all right a lot remember i said earlier that this person is going to feel like this this whoever this new person is stole their family okay so rich guy thief and sweetheart so whoever this divine masculine that is coming towards you this divine masculine is going to be showing up as a king of pentacles here a rich guy okay and the the person that is in your past is going to be saying that this person stole you which is the sweetheart here okay this person stole you from me this person stole your my family from me okay this is what somebody is saying in the energy here okay however they no longer get any access to you okay i'm also hearing that there's somebody saying um uh, you don't answer your phone for me anymore you don't even do this no more like you you blocked me this is the energy but this is somebody who is definitely trying to um talk to you about this new person and this new person stealing something from them okay this masculine has a lot of animosity towards your new divine partner your new divine partner is showing up here he, he may have muscles okay he may be the guy that wear one the fitted shirts because he has a nice upper body okay this is the energy that i'm getting courthouse and real love okay this masculine is going to be talking to you about marrying this person okay north no energy okay this is going to be your divine partner all right i'm seeing 113 somebody's birthday could be january 13th here but whoever this is this person is your past person is going to be talking about you marrying 
this new person this he does not want this to happen this is the reason why he's up under a lot of pressure this masculine is like racing against time to try to talk you out of something that you are doing i'm also seeing that there is anger here okay there's a lot of anger here in this in this energy okay this person is definitely trying to convince you you need more here We got the ice king we got the bondage and then we got actual money okay i'm also seeing that whoever this your past person is he's showing up here as an ice king but this is also something else that he's talking about he's saying that somebody's trying to trap you in for money somebody trying to be with you for money all right this ain't gonna work that's gonna be a problem i'm trying to warn you i'm trying to warn you somebody is trying to warn you about some sort of disaster some sort of um calamity that's going to happen if you continue to go forward with your divine party this is what your karmic past is telling you they're telling you that somebody is trying to trap you in for money okay now what i'm getting in this energy whoever you are you are somebody who's not looking to have a partner that um your sole reason is not money okay i'm seeing that whoever you are you are somebody who has your own money your past partner can see this as well okay but your past partner is having a lot of problems because you are elevating all right you're in a different position than you were when you were with that person all right this person your past person is now seeing you with money or seeing you with things okay and this person is saying that they they feel as if they're missing out on a shot with you they feel as if they they had it right in the palm of their hands but now it is gone or now it's is, is about to go and be with somebody else so this person is doing a lot of talking about this rich guy using you for money or only wanting to be with you for money here okay that is the energy that is the energy here give me more a lot of conversation this person is trying to have with you don't know if this person is present now okay but this person is definitely trying to have a lot of conversation with you okay we got mature man all right this person is possibly saying that he's a mature man now okay this person is also saying that they have changed okay this person could be born in september okay so i just seen september but this person is definitely um talking about him changing he's different this person may come to you next month all right or in less than a month this person may be coming to you all right we got energy of this mature man here let's see what this is i'm getting that the yeah i cannot make it up bro i cannot make this up okay listen what did i say didn't i say your past person coming back telling you oh he changed he changed he changed i could have said this was the new guy this was the new guy no the energy told me this was your past person that said he changed and what came out change all right so your past person is saying that he changed here okay he could be coming back to you within this next month or less than a month okay coming back to you as a perfect angel i've changed boo boo i've changed okay this is what this person is coming as all right listen what all right, so what's this lustful energy here, okay? So this person is going to be trying to kiss all over you, okay? Try to get you in that energy, start some sort of a new beginning here. But this person is coming, talking about that they have changed. This person is trying to get you back wrapped up in your emotions about them, okay? Listen, may even convince you like, they they will be trying to trap you. This is the energy. This is somebody that's working against your, your divine party, your divine partner. Okay? This is what this is. This is somebody working against your divine partner, trying to snatch you up, back up off the market before anything happened here. Okay? This is what this person is going through. This person feels like they're running out of time. Okay? Can't make it up running. Running, running out of time. Okay? This is how this person is seeing it. They are running out of time. Mm hmm This is the energy. Give me more on this lust and offer here. Crazy over you is what I just heard. Wow. 
That's a lot. Listen, your success is hurting this person. That's a problem. That is, this is the problem right here. Right here. This person didn't see you as being successful as you are. Okay, confirmation. This person, okay, this is too many. But I'm going to take, I'm going to show you what that is. Commitment. Listen, it was laying here. All right. This person, this is not a, a real commitment. It's laying on my thumb. This person want to put a ring on your thumb, not the right finger. Okay. This is the energy. It's a problem. This person is, is so worried about you moving on with somebody else, but this person is very focused on the success you have, um, you have right now. Okay. Success, single, sexy. All right. This person is, is, is having a hard time. We got the eight of, of pentacles here. We got the eight of pentacles that was right here too as well. We got nice guy. All right. We got eight of scarabs or eight of pentacles and six of scepters. Yeah. This person is seeing that um, whatever you're doing is working for you. All right. With the eight of um, scarabs and the six of scepters here, whatever you're doing right now, it is working for you. And this person sees it. Okay. I'm seeing a nice guy here. I don't know who this is. Who is this nice guy? I didn't get no energy off of it. It's like neutral energy here. Yes, yeah, you see the two hearts? All right, you got your divine party that's, that's the nice guy. And then you got your other person that's coming talking about he the nice guy. Okay? This is like competition here. What is this nice guy? We got unexpected money. What is this nice guy? And then mentally unstable in reverse, okay? So this is somebody, I'm getting that this is, give me one more. Bottom of the deck community. Give me one more. Oh, you gave me two. Yeah, this your past person. This your past person. All right, that's the energy. This is your past person. Nice guy, unexpected money. All right, this one coming in like this. All right, pretending to be stable. All right, but they really got a problem. All right, they not on the right path. Whoever this person is. This is somebody pretending to be stable, pretending to be something that they are not. And it's all because of something that they did not expect you to even get. All right, this person is all in your pocket without being all in your pocket. All right, this is the energy here. Intuitive and distant future. Ancestors are saying you know to keep this person away from you. Keep a distance between you and this person. There is no more sparks here from what I'm seeing. All right, I'm, I see hubris. Okay, so I don't know what that is. I'm going to have to look that up. But I believe that's some sort of it. I'm getting an earth angel. Okay, I'm getting an earth angel there. Yeah. Ancestors are saying go far away. All right, abandon the idea, abandon this person unless you want to be in karma, a committed karmic relationship. Okay, this is what ancestors is saying. Yes, yeah, stuck in it. All right, remember, I said, whatever you do, whatever you're settling in now, when it comes to this um, eclipse new moon energy, you're gonna be fixed in it. Okay, fixed in it. All right, blocked. Okay, this is the energy here. Okay, there's a lot of twenty nine ninety nine. Look that up. Twenty nine ninety nine here. All right. Anything else? Okay, I'm being told to bring light to um, the industry. Something about the industry and the couples in the industry. Okay, ancestors are saying. Notice how um, the couples in the industry are being separated. Okay, example: Kirk Frost and Rashida Frost. Okay. Another example, something going on, okay, with Judy and Debrat, okay. This is things are being separated, okay. If you if you haven't noticed, there's a lot of separations happening at this time. It's not just in the industry, but ancestors are saying, notice what you're seeing. People are being separated. People that are not each other's divine couples, they are being separated here. Okay, this is the energy. Give me more here. We got another health card here. So it's the second health card. All right. And then we got travel. Mm. And 
then we got Jezebel here. Okay, so ooh, I listen. I didn't hear the trash, so I don't think this is a present energy. But let me look into it. Give me one more on this. All right. So this is what I'm getting here. And we got false at the bottom. All right. So we got health concern, travel, and Jezebel. All right. So I'm getting that there's somebody who's, uh, listen, there's somebody who's passing things out. There's a Jezebel here that's passing things out. Okay. You get a car, you get a car, you get a car type situation, okay? You get a disease, you get a disease. Whoever this is, this person is passing out whatever she has, whatever bad health that she has, she's traveling with it, okay? And ancestors have surprise in reverse, okay? I'm getting that this is not a surprise either to you, okay? Or this is not a surprise to this past person of yours, okay whatever is going on it has to do with somebody's health here second okay and this person is worried okay this person is worried okay i'm getting that this is your past person that's worried okay this person i'm getting that this wow this person is acting as if they they something was found out all right but it's no surprise to your person okay or your past person all right this is a challenge all right, this is the challenge and the adversity this person is going through right now. This person is worried about their own health, okay? This person could possibly be sick and not say anything to you. This is the confirmation. This is the energy here. I'm getting that there's somebody uh, not believing in some sort of uh, document, okay? Some sort of health document. They saying and that ain't right. That's false. That's false. This is somebody in denial about a health concern here. This is what I'm getting here. Somebody was dealing with a unhealthy Jezebel, and it's, it's, it's no surprise to them. Whatever it is, it is no surprise to them, and this person is worried about their own health, but they are refuting whatever result this is. Okay? This person is, nah, that ain't true. That ain't true. Mm -mm. No, that ain't true. This is how this person is, okay? Healer. All right? So I'm getting that this person is definitely trying to make their way back to you. Concern. Listen, this is the concern. Like they, they now like I need to heal. I need, I need to heal. Like that ain't right. This ain't right. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. I need to heal. Uh 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 uh. <coughs> All right. So this person is trying. This person have a little cough. <coughs> okay. So this person, listen. This person is trying to make their way back to you because they need some sort of divine healing here this person is very concerned with a situation this person could have found out something this person's birthday could be um october 2nd or february 10th okay this is the energy here this person's birthday could also be in june somebody found something out here all right they was dealing with a, a jezebel they found something out here uh things ain't good things is not good all right, this person is trying to make their way back to you. They're in denial about some sort of health issue. All right, anything else here? Okay, they're saying switch the day. Animosity. All right, so that person could be holding some sort of animosity towards you because you are in a different space in your life you're just in a different completely different space this person is not holding it's not like a for real personal grudge like something happened between you two but this person is kind of like holding animosity because you are in good health okay and this person has something tolling over on them this person has something weighing on them this person is coming kind of angry okay a little bit bitter here give me more here This person is upset because there's no more sparks flying between you guys. No more sparks. Yeah, I can't make it up. Uninterested. You uninterested. This person has a lot of animosity because them sparks is like dead. Dead. Okay? You're into some sort of growth here, okay? Laughing at the situation. You don't want to hear it. You ain't got nothing to do with it. Like, this is how you are feeling. Okay, you giving this person it's something that they want don't want to hear. You telling them something that they don't want to hear. Okay, I'm hearing somebody say, I don't need you to tell me that. 
I don't need you to tell me that. Whoever this is, this person is very upset. Okay, I'm hearing, ain't no us. It ain't no us. So somebody is talking about being back together or whatever, and somebody is saying it ain't no us. Listen, this person is tricking you. This person is positive. Can't make it up. I can't make it up, bro. This person is positive. You know what I'm talking about? Okay? You know what I'm talking about. This person is positive. Okay? Who They went and got tested. All right, this person showed up positive, okay? They're tricking you. They're not telling you that this Jezebel went and got tested, and they went and got tested, or the Jezebel went and got tested, and this person is in denial like that was false. That was false. It probably false. It's probably false. Try to tell the Jezebel that it's false, okay? Whoever he is, he is not healthy, okay? That is the energy here. That's a shame, bro. That's a shame. This person is definitely making their way back. I am seeing there is no sparks here. There is no sparks here. Not with a divine feminine. What else here? Greed. Remember, this person was looking, he paying attention to the bag. He trying to say that somebody is with you for money, but this person wants you for that exact reason. Money. Okay? Have a lot of animosity towards your bag and your health. Give me more here. Listen. Negative showed up in reverse. That's positive. That's a whole nother positive. Okay? This person was dabbling in the coochie a little bit too much. Greedy with it. Okay? Showing up positive here. This is the energy here. All right, we got uncertain. There she go. Boy, listen. Remember, every time it's a karmic, the trash going. Every time. All right, this person is uncertain on whether or not they are positive or negative with an STD. All right, this is the energy. They are positive, whoever this is. They stuck with somebody. We got plans here, small favor. What is this? Brag. Okay, so I'm getting that you are somebody who is about to be bragging, and you, you're going to have bragging rights, okay? Your plans are going as they are supposed to be going here. We got plans and brag here. This is you laughing with your growth here. Chaos, you ain't you ain't got nothing to do with the No, I can't make it up, bro. Yo, you like, I'm out of here. Goodbye. Goodbye, your issues is your issues, and your issues will stay. Your issues here. This is what a divine feminine is doing. You're you got plans that you can brag about. You got things that you're doing that you can brag about. You no longer in the chaos. You like goodbye. I don't have nothing to do with that. Okay, this is your energy. You are saying I have nothing to do with that. Your bad news. Okay, bad news for you. You shouldn't have been out there entertaining folks. Okay. This is the energy here, being dishonest, all right? So this is somebody who was work, trying to work you, trying to, and ended up getting caught up. Ended up getting caught up. Anything else here? I just heard it's a goodbye. <laughs> I just heard it's giving note, okay? Look, friends with benefits, FWB, okay? I just also heard SWV, all right? So, sisters with voices. So, I'm getting that this is somebody, y'all starting to speak up, whoever y'all are. Listen, this person was experimenting out there. This person was experimenting. Friends with benefits and something has happened. Something has happened here. Sisters with voices, this is women, divine feminists who are starting to speak up and no means, yo no means, no now. Nah. I cannot make it up. You're laughing about the situation. You're laughing and not because somebody is ill or somebody is sick, but you're laughing because I told you who I was type energy. This is where you at with it. I told you who I was, but you were so busy trying to make a person jealous. Okay. This is what you're saying to this individual. You were so busy trying to make me jealous type energy. Okay? 
that you ended up getting yourself caught up in a situation. This is what a divine feminine is telling someone. Confirmation. All right? Whoever you are, this person was trying to make you jealous to the point to where you like, listen, listen. Interested in incompatibility. Okay? You was interested, but now you're like, we are incompatible. Like, do you, listen, obsessed in reverse, you no longer care about this situation. Okay? But this is somebody who was trying to make you jealous, and you are saying this to this person. You are saying it's your fault because you should not have been trying to make me jealous. This is somebody said that. Okay? We got unavailable here. You're now showing up as unavailable. You don't want nothing to do with this person's problems. That's what I'm seeing. You don't want nothing to do with this person's problems. This person feels like they were robbed. Okay, with thieves showing up here. They feel as if they were robbed. We need more here. Yeah. You, you're putting an end to something. You done. You like, listen, I'm not letting nobody pass this table, pass these cups. I'm protecting. I'm very guarded out here. I'm protecting myself. I'm not doing anything. This is how a divine feminine is feeling. You're showing up here with the nine of cups and the death card. You like, mm -mm, I'm straight. You are releasing something. Okay. And as you are releasing something with the hangman, you are getting more op op options and opportunities handed to you with the eight of wands. Okay. Confirmation confirmation somebody dodged a bullet here this is what i'm feeling somebody dodged a bullet listen you ain't wounded with the nine of wands showing up in reverse you now you refuse to be stuck and wounded you refuse to be stuck and wounded okay listen i cannot make it up you block that you protected yourself from that. You put a fort up. You was like, mm-mm. You cannot pass go. You cannot collect $200. Okay? This is how you felt. We got Monopoly. Okay, but I'm picking up Polly here. I'm picking up Polly. Somebody was very loose. Somebody was very, very loose. You was, I think, Mono, and they were Polly. Okay? You were for one person. They were for many okay this is the energy we got boundaries here all right yeah you were setting some sort of boundaries here this person was for the streets though this person was giving everybody some this is the energy i'm picking up on a heavy energy of poly i'm in reverse here okay a heavy energy of poly it's mutual com committed and we got queer here Yeah, this person was for the streets. This person was doing a lot of things with a lot of people. All right? Where's that deck? Because I hate to grab that deck, but I'm going to grab it. I'm going to grab it. Okay, we got mixed signals here. Yeah, this person was a little loose. A little loose caboose. Runaway train. Yeah, that's, that's, yeah. This person was with every, a lot of folk person was with a lot of folk oh I, I need to start boxing up my uh cards because i'm gonna be moving whenever god bless me he done already had me packed i don't know why i'm packed but i'm packed everything all my clothes is packed okay i'm gonna be moving yes i guess all right let's see I don't grab these cards unless it's like, you know, they're having arguments. Whoever this is, they're having arguments. And this person is trying to argue with you as well. Um, I only got these cards. That This is showing me LGBTQ. All right. There's a lot going on here. We got manifesting and then we got regret. Somebody's trying to manifest you back because they are regretting. This is not okay remember they said i'm ready 
okay this person is now ready for a relationship with you but i'm getting that this person is no longer healthy enough to be with you this person is no longer healthy i can't make it up okay wounded okay wounded with the band-aid okay this person is unfixable i mean they they're fixable but you know this person is, is dealing with something now not ready to commit all right this is the energy here not ready they may be ready but their body is not healthy all right this is the energy here we got twin flames and we got inconsistent this person is very inconsistent but they're coming to you talking about some sort of twin flame energy here some sort of soulmate energy here all right whoever this is you should let him go whoever this is this person needs to be let go anything else here i think i love you all right this person is trying to keep you from moving on this person doesn't know how to love is what i'm getting here question mark this person has a question mark in their heart it's always a question confirmation it's always a question here we got blissful love new love you got something else coming through okay i'm seeing third party in the background but you got a new love coming through this person is still dealing with a third party romance this is what i'm getting here okay i'm not seeing the card that i that that confirms this queer confirm the queer here confirm queer mm. okay so this person is like for the streets all right this person do a lot with a lot okay this person is not fighting fair okay not fighting fair when i say not fighting fair this person when this person get mad this person want to sleep with you because they know something is wrong here all right this is the energy okay protect yourself ladies and gentlemen ladies and gentlemen gentlemen okay i don't know what song that is but that's what i got um that was truly divinely sent to someone who needed to hear it listen I have recorded over on the other channel. I'm divinely faceted. All right. The last one that I did is concerning dreams. If you've been getting certain type of dreams, weird dreams, you may want to look at that. All right. It's I'm divinely faceted. All right. But this message here was sent to someone who needed to hear it. Hit the like button, comment, and subscribe. And I will catch you on the next one.